alpha and beta particles are charged whereas gamma radiation is neutral. Remember that opposite charges attract, so if you were to fire all three particles through an electric or magnetic field, the alpha particles would deflect towards the cathode, the beta particles to the anode, and of course the gamma would just pass straight through without a care in the world. When radiation collides with molecules in living cells, it can damage them. If the DNA in the nucleus of a cell is damaged, the cell may become cancerous. The cell then goes out of control, divides rapidly and causes serious health problems. Very high doses of radiation can kill the cell completely, which can cause radiation poisoning. If you accidentally swallow some radiation, as you do, then you better hope it's not alpha, because they are the biggest particles and are easily absorbed by living cells. Beta and gamma radiation are not as dangerous because they are less likely to come into contact with your cells, as they are so tiny that they will most probably pass straight out of you. On the other hand, if someone throws a piece of radioactive material at you, the big alpha particles wouldn't penetrate as easily because they are too big. Beta and gamma, however, would pass straight through you and cause damage. Thanks for watching. Make sure to hit the like button and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and want to see some more. You can also follow me on Twitter at DoodleSci if you want to.